Come see what's happening at Maui's newest dealership, Jim Falk Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram, located at 195 Putunani Avenue, and the cars and trucks are in stock and ready for delivery. Aloha folks, it's Kiora Balul with Maui Now, here at Hyatt Regency Maui, where visitors, locals, and chefs alike are welcoming celebrity chef Vikram Vich, who's here to teach them some of the tricks of the trade. This is a man who has three restaurants, he's world renowned, and he has a bigger vision about more than just what's on your plate. First of all, namaste. The way you say aloha in Hindi, we say namaste, which is a form of welcome in India. It means my energy goes to you, and your energy comes back to me. So namaste to all the people. Of Maui. He's been, you know, honored by Bon Appetit, Travel and Leisure, uh, Gourmet Magazine, Television, Food Network, etc. It goes on and on. So we're very excited to have him here. So our chef arrived on Sunday. Uh, we met yesterday, and I think I'm in love with this guy. I mean, this, is, I mean, this person now is great. Baking is an art and a science. Cooking is a democracy. A little bit of this and a little bit of that. So we have some spices in front of you that I want you to kind of look at, taste. Curry is not a spice. Curry is a blend of cumin, cloves, cinnamon, ginger, garlic. It's a blend of so many different spices. You cannot be allergic to curry. That's like saying I'm allergic to music. Spices are like notes to me, right? They sing to me, the cloves, the ginger, the garlic. They sing to me the same way as the notes would to a musician or paints or colors are to a painter. Same way, same thing, different artistry, different angles, but the love and the passion is still the same. So I'm gonna start making a masala. Masala is a blend of onions, ginger, garlic, and a starting point of every Indian cooking is a masala. I'll brown the onions, then I'll add the ginger and the garlic, then I'll add all the spices to it. Use your hands when you're eating food. There's nothing better than when you eat food and you go, like this, it's the most delicious feeling of it. I think time has come for us to break down boundaries of cuisines and rather than being an Indian, a French, a Canadian and a German cuisine, we should be a cuisine of the world basically. We should become one and when you break bread with each other, it doesn't matter where you come from, what your ethnicity is, what your culture is, you learn to accept people. The style of cooking was never meant to be overly um, complicated. It was meant to be just simple. Have fun. Relax. See that onions are brown? Right? And now the garlic and ginger will go in there. So I'm waiting for the onions and ginger and garlic to brown up a little bit. And uh, I'm going to add some cumin seeds to brown them and some whole coriander seeds. And then the chicken goes at the end and we finish it off with sour cream. As a chef, it is your job to embrace where you live, where you cook from. And so one of the things that we created was a little bit of a raita, a yogurt with local uh, papayas and mangoes and fresh cilantro. The land has given us such a bounty. The ocean has given us such a bounty that we as Americans and Canadians should be so proud of what we have in our backyard and we need to be proud of it. When people complain about that, oh my God, my parking spot is like two blocks away from your shop, I look at them like, really dude, go to third world countries and you'll see how lucky we are where we live. So it doesn't get any better than this. And Chef says don't be afraid of the Indian spices, just know them well and realize that every one of them has a health benefit. You can learn more about that in my article on MauiNow.com. I'm Kira Balul for Maui Now. Mahalo for watching.